Hey, it's Adam here at DirectionTrader.com. I'm uh, going to make a video on how to uh, copy and paste code into the Thinkorswim charts. Well, let me start here. Um, the rule applies um, how you apply these codes to each chart, whether it be the tick, 400 tick, 1600 tick, advanced decline, uh, the breath indicator, uh, all works the same. So whatever chart you want to go to, go up to studies, edit studies, and then in here you'll see your um, your studies. I'm going to delete mine so I will have nothing showing. So basically you got a plain grid here. That's how you all start. Click OK. All right, now on my website, I have now in the members area posted the code to uh, show the clouds and the moving averages that I use. Basically, you would go to directiontrader.com. Sorry about that, got a phone ringing in the background. Direction Trader. And then once you become a member, you get a username and password take you to the members area under getting started down here at the bottom right there will be underneath setting up the charts will be codes to finish developing your charts just click on this and then it will bring up all the codes that you might need um, we're going to use the 400 tick moving averages and just show you how to put them in there. So basically, you're just going to take them and copy the code. Stops right there. This would be the 1600 and the so and so forth. Damn, I wish that phone would stop ringing. Just copy it. Get rid of this. You go up to Studies, Edit Studies. And under Edit Studies down here in the bottom left, you'll click New. And then simply go up, right click, paste that code that you just copied from a website. I can get rid of this. You don't need both these up here. So it says Input Price equals Close. You can just get rid of one of them. But yeah, yours might not do that, but. Anyways, so yeah, that's the code. As long as it doesn't come up with any red highlighted areas, the code is right. Basically, you can name it whatever you want. Um, I've named it something else. Uh, but yeah, say like you want to name it 400 tick. It's pretty easy. Then click enter. Blah, blah, blah. That's not really what I want to use, but yep. So, all right, so I called it A. Click down here, code's good, okay. And then it's brought up here. I call it A, obviously, it's not what you want. But So, you're gonna have a 200 simple moving average, a 100 simple moving average, and a 50 EMA. And they're all, just click apply, and okay. And looky there, there's your chart. It added the moving averages with the cloud. So basically, when the 50 is yellow, the 100 is the dark blue, and the 200 is light blue. So when the 50 EMA crosses the 100 SMA, the cloud will turn from green to red, representing a bear and bull market, and so on and so forth. So that's an easy way to uh, add uh, code into your charts. I'm going to go back and re-enter mine. So once you save them, like notice I saved that last one as A or whatever it was. It'll be in there, but I've got them saved as DT, which stands for Direction Trade or something. Damn, my phone needs to stop ringing. All right, so here's mine. Apply, enter, and it looks the same. So, All right, that's how you add code to your charts. If you have any questions, email me. Give me a call. Email will be better, and I will either get back to you by call or email and uh, help you, and we'll go through this step by step. All right, thanks. Adam.